So here we are in Florida, day one. It's red hot. How are you, Ben? Hot. Yeah, really hot. hot. Nice here, isn't it? Yeah, it is to be fair, it's a nice place. It's just really, really hot. Yeah, trained this morning. Um, it's probably 30 degrees by about 10 to 9. Um, it just got hotter and hotter, didn't it, through the session. But um, where we're training is alright, pitches are good, so that would be, be good. It was a 10 hour flight from Manchester to Orlando, and here's how we got here. Someone's received your Yeah. First out of the left side. Thank you. Hello, guys. Welcome on flight for me, I didn't sleep, so I started off watching, um, what did I watch? Bad Boys 2. Bad Boys 2, yeah, me. Bad Boys 2. I don't know what you were watching. Back of my eyelids. Yeah, and then, yeah. And then I looked across <laughs> about an hour and a half later expecting some conversation to pass a bit of time, and you were... Doing my own thing. Yeah, I two doing. masks on covering <laughs> your whole face, and snoring away. So it was a bit of a lonely one for me. Yeah, so we've got a bit of downtime. Um, obviously, we're not allowed out the hotel because of the COVID bubble, so kind of in our rooms. So we've all got a, got, got a series. I hope you're watching a minute. Not the minute, no. No series. Um, I want to get into that thing that you're watching, though. Empire. Empire, yeah. On series three. It's decent. It's good, yeah, good series. Start it's that. An enjoyable time. Time passer. Amazon Prime. Yeah, you need a time passer when you're you're telling that on a night, don't you? There's only so much Love Island, one, one person. Yeah, watch, Love Island, I forgot about that, yeah. We've got a couple of new faces that we signed this week. Here's our newest blue, Damari Gray. Well, Damari, welcome to Everton. How does it feel to have joined the club? Yeah, I'm delighted. Um, to obviously be back in the Premier League at such a big club and you know, I'm excited to you know kick on again back in the Premier League and like I said, I'm excited to play with the team and get to work. The club has ambitions to be back among the elite. You're a Premier League winner. You've played in the Champions League. So how hungry are you to achieve more success with Everton? Yeah, um, that's going to be the main goal. I think, you know, the manager and his ambition and also what he's won um, in his past, uh, I think that's um, key for the team. And I think as a club, we'll look to push forward and compete with you know the top clubs. And I think a club of this magnitude has all the potential to be back right up there. You would have had other options. So who did you speak to and what were the key reasons for you to join Everton? Yeah, um, for me, like I said, growing up, Everton's always known to be a big club. Uh, many great players have played for Everton and an opportunity to be back in the Premier League at a club like this was something I couldn't turn down. And yeah, like I said, I'm delighted and speaking to the manager and you know Marcel, had a real good feel for the club and I feel like this is a place where I can continue to develop because there's obviously areas of my game where you know I still want to improve and I'll you know, become better at so yeah it's a uh, feel like for me at my age and the targets I've set for myself and what the club's ambitions are for like collectively uh, everything fat and felt right to me and like I said I'm delighted and excited to kick on. Um, you played with Damara before, haven't you? Yeah, I played with him at England um, in the under 20s and the 21s. So, both the same age as me, so both ages. Did you play against him at, when he was at Leicester? Yeah, I played against him a few times, I think. Um, you tweeted him like that? No. Don't tell him. No. no. He said he did. I don't think he did. I don't, I don't think he did. You, you can't have said that on day one, <laughs> no, could he? No, he didn't, he didn't say that. <laughs> He didn't say that. Andros and Asmir joined this week too. 
How do you think they're settling in? Yeah, good. Obviously, them two have had a lot of clubs before, they're experienced. So, to have that experience come in is only going to help us as a squad. And obviously, they're not new to going into new dressing room, so they've settled in well. Yeah, I assume right there. Next question was about adding experience, so you basically answered that. In well, so I like to do. I like to preempt what's coming. Ben, yeah. I've got some more questions here for you. What was your first football memory? First football memory? Um, it was probably the World Cup when Zidane got sent off in the final. It's my first football memory. Yeah, I'm like, well, you're not that much no. older than me. I mean, what? younger than me. How old, what year was it? 2004? Six. You've got to have a memory before that. Yeah, probably. You'd have about 12, though. Yeah, but what do you mean, like me or as in a... Just any like first time you remember Probably football. Probably joining my local team then, pure. What was your initiation song at Everton? But you didn't do one, did you? Yeah, I did. You were injured, um, killing me softly. Right. Which keys? No. Who sings that? Lauren Hill. Oh yeah, poor from me, that. Huh? Honestly, I'm so hot. I'm melting here, <laughs> and I keep burning myself on this chair. <laughs> Favorite part of pre-season. <laughs> Um, what, a, what, a no, what a no answer question this is. <laughs> um, sun. Yeah, sun, nice one. I don't even know it's not now. Yeah, normal sun in the UK. The worst like part of pre season? The flights if you come somewhere like this. I don't hours. mind flights. It's just because you sleep. This heat, yeah. Yeah, it's a good point. Would you rather train in the heat or the cold? This is a tough one. I would actually rather train in here, but look at me now. Yes. Feel like an extreme of either is not great for you, yeah. is it? Really? Fingers were cold though, your fingers and that. Are... Yeah, it's not great. How excited are you to face Million Aros on Sunday? Yeah, it'll be a good test. I'm excited. Obviously, the cups change a little bit with teams dropping out, but games are games, so I'm looking forward to it. He's so hot. I'm, He's I'm so hot. Melting. Last question Are you excited? to be back in packed stadiums. Yeah. Cheers. How long has it been? 18 months. What, since it's full? Yeah. About Probably longer. Months, it? Yeah, it's been too long. Right, so it's the part of the show where you get to ask us anything. Thank you for your questions and here goes. Mason, do you think Jeff Bozo, who's Jeff Bozo? Is that the guy who owns Tesla? Amazon, oh. Do you think Jeff Bozo's could see Ben Godfrey's shoulders from space. Probably. <laughs> no, I don't think. Nah, actually, nah, yeah, you're quite warm, innit? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, probably, yeah. I don't know who Jeff Bozo is, but it depends how good his cameras are, innit? Yeah. What American sports teams do you follow? Not really. mm. Honestly, I'm not massive. American sports. Not a massive sports person. There's a few uh, there's a few that I know, but I wouldn't say I, I, it's different times, isn't it? I don't I'd really like to, but stay I just, my knowledge isn't that good. Yeah. You've got to start somewhere, yeah, aren't you? Yeah. And then you don't really know what you're talking about and then Yeah. Can you do a Scouse accent? This is BG's territory. This is all over BG. Not a chance He's I'm having it. That. I've seen I've heard you do it before. Yeah, but I'm not doing it. Alright. No then we can't. Who controls the music in the locker room? What do they play? Is there a song or artist that is forbidden? You are all in it. Oh, how selfish. Yeah, so, I, yeah, so it's On me. a game day, it's Craig, isn't it? Yeah, on an actual game day, it's Craig, but in pre-season, I've had it so yeah, far. Yeah, you've had it. Um, I've just gone and been going old school, old school R&B, hip-hop, like Biggie Smalls, Tupac. Juicy was yeah. booming over there, wasn't it? That's where I'm... I feel like that incorporates a bit of everyone, yeah. no matter who, no matter what, what you you know it, don't you? So I feel like it's a nice safe. It's hard one. to please everyone, though. Yeah. Music. So, awesome. but I feel like that one sits in category yeah. of pleasing a good eighty percent of the changing room. Yeah. So can't really go wrong. Um, if you want to follow me on SoundCloud, it's DJ Macy Mace. Don't waste um, your time. <laughs> <laughs> Who is the funniest member? <laughs> <laughs> um, who is the funniest member of the squad? Dave would put himself up there. Yeah, but I, no. But I think he, he's just different, isn't he? He's, he? Yeah. 
you, John. Is this where you delay saying that you're funniest and like you just Ah, I'm funny, like right? I'm up there. I know, I know, I know, I know my humour's up there. Like I'm trying to think. There's different people are funny Dif for different, different things. Reasons, yeah. Alex is funny. Though, Alex is funny, but Alex don't mean to be funny. Yeah. That's what makes Alex funny. Like, there's, yeah, there's a, there's, depends who you ask, I think, and it depends what kind of humour you're looking for. What is your favourite US-based food? Based food? US-based? I don't know. See, I might say something silly here. French fries. Are they American or are they French? It's just chips, isn't it? Yeah, but I don't know if they're American or they're French. Oh. <laughs> no. They're not French, though, are they? Well, why are they called French fries? Yeah. Which player is most likely to win at Everton Royal Rumble? You're a bit lightweight. I feel like you're getting thrown over the ropes by like Kino or or Yeri. It's not a fight. It's a Royal uh, Rumble. Ah, yeah, Royal Rumble. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's a Royal Rumble, isn't it? Yeri's got to be up there. Yeah, I think I'd be. Yeri. You're not chucking him out, ring. No, you can't get him at physically. It's a four-man job. It takes yeah. me, you, John, Dave. Or... Yeah, it's like when Kane, Kane, and Undertaker, Big yeah, Show, yeah. Big Show, when you had Mark to like, Henry. yeah, you <laughs> running like, yeah, it's what you'd take, I think. Mark Henry. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think he's got to be one of the big lads, hasn't it? Who's just yeah, getting, well, well, not getting well. thrown off. I'll use you as a weapon. <laughs> Pick me up, <laughs> whack me around. <laughs> Keep it down, eh? How cool. Oh, I've, I can't. No. How can I be as cool as Tom Davis? It's one of a kind. I don't think there's a yeah, Tom I feel Davis like on the planet. If you try and be like Tom Davis. You're gonna you're get nowhere cool near. As, you're not as cool. It's not yeah. you. It has to be kind of you, doesn't it? Yeah. Like you have to be you to to be classed as cool. It's got like, to be It has to be like what you want to yeah. do. I don't think I'll ever meet a Tom. Someone. I'll never meet a Tom Davis again in my life. I won't. Nah, nah, you can't. But that's just him. He's always been like that. So that's the beauty of why Tom Davis is so cool. Because Tom Davis is Tom Davis and nobody else. There's your answer. That's true. Andrew. Andy. Who is the fastest player? Ben, yeah, I'd say Ben. Ben or Dom? Ben, I'd like to yeah, see ben, that ben, Dom. ben, then Dom. There's your answer. Ben, then no, we've Dom. chatted about this before, me and Dom, and he says it's same. Who's got fastest thing, you? Yeah. Yeah, it's Ben, then, isn't it? No, no arguments. Do you play golf? What handicap do you have? Well, <laughs> well, war a man. I don't know how they say that, but you've come to the right man because I've recently started in the golf game. So is Ben. His clubs are just at shop at the moment. Yeah, I'm going to be a new starter soon. Mm, it's warming you to play it. Off, what do you play off, 22? Depends who, Depends if it's a serious game. If it's not, I'd move my handicap. You found I've got a loose handicap just yeah. to try and cheat a little bit. Yeah. If it's, if it's a serious game where there might be a little bit of money on it or something, when I'm playing with Mike and Matt, I'd push my handicap up to like 22, 24. If it's just me playing for no reason with a couple of boys and there's no on it, I might oh, knock four. myself down to 18. <laughs> just see who depends what day I'm on. A little bit of a golf bandit, but that's how winners win. <laughs> Thanks for all your questions. That's it from us here in Florida today in 40 degree heat. And the rest. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the show. Tune in tomorrow. See you soon. Right, shade, shade, shade.